Anderson Ward in hot pursuit. Plus to Coglu across, trying to find Egan. Egan is there. Egan with a chance to shoot. Egan shoots and Egan scores. Well, a very, very sharp move indeed. And it all started on the left from Postacoglu. Shoved the ball across for Egan, who just steadied, took his time, and planted the ball past Martin Crook in the Adelaide Hellas goal. McDowell, Postacoglu. Pulls. To Craney, Craney through to Poster Coglu, Poster Coglu there with a the header uh, to Davis and Davis's header, and then eventually through to uh, Nicolaides, but uh, the goal is disallowed. The, the flag was up, the linesman's flag on the far side of the field was up long before Nicolaides actually had that shot. Murphy forward again for Egan. Alfred the dummy run, Davidson not having the best of afternoons is Alan Davidson, but now Panagy's in control through to Honeyman. Honeyman slips it past Russell to Manu, Manu up forward for Ward. Ward on the left, the cross comes in, Constantopoulos with a header. And Lormetz accepted that one as a fairly easy catch. Scott trying to get past Davison, but still has the ball. Yankos. Lou Histadulu. Clever on the turn, fast on the break, into the box, across. Ward almost got a foot to that, but not quite. And then it's Honeyman who drives it high over the crossbar. Well, the most promising attack yet from the home team, but it all broke down when Ward couldn't quite reach what looked to be an excellent pass from Lou Histadulu and eventually Honeyman slammed the ball high over the crossbar. Rainey tries to get it through, Histadulu blocks it, falls to Postacoglu, Postacoglu avoids a tackle from Panagy, so now he's on the left in a dangerous situation, crossed the goal but far too high. Postacoglu not very pleased with himself with that effort, the one he put over in the fourth minute, wasn't it, John? Was much more effective. Yes, uh, he certainly looks very dangerous every time he gets forward down that left-hand side. And I think this is the answer for the Adelaide side, Alan. They've got to get Scott and Timmy Brown forward out wide because that's when they look most dangerous. Whenever they've got forward, they do look very dangerous. Egan demonstrating his excellent skills. True for Craney and true for Nicolaitis. Nicolaitis with a oh, shot and it's a goal. Great goal. Great shot. Marvellous goal. A splendid move. Beautifully polished off by Nicolaitis. Egan on the Craney. Craney relayed it to Nicolaitis and Nicolaitis buried it with clinical precision past Martin Crook in the Adelaide Hellas goal. And the home team entered this game with high hopes of success, find themselves two goals down. Alfred, cut out by Brown, Yankos, Craney intercepted, punches exchanged, referee gets in the centre of them, the yellow card must be produced surely on this occasion for both players but no, Charlie Yankos a bit lucky there, card for both Craney and Charlie Yankos, both sent off as they exchange blows. They're remonstrating with the referee, but the decision has been made. The red card has been produced and the players must come off. And very dejectedly, the two players come off the field. Danny Craney of South Melbourne and uh, Charlie Yankos of Adelaide Hellas, the first time that either of these players have been sent off since they started.